I'm not just throwing, I'm scared. <laughs> oh my god. Holy Whoa. crap. Look at how blue they are. Welcome back to another awesome video guys as you can tell we're here at a very cool spot today a place We have been multiple times on the channel and we've caught some awesome fish before so today we have a fish trap once again Let me give you a little rundown if you have not watched previous videos here Basically this canal right here this tiny little creek I just found it recently in the past like month or so and out of here We have caught eastern happies, which are a type of African cichlid. We've caught bumblebee African cichlids We've caught jewel cichlids jaguar cichlids uh, What else convict cichlids Mayan tilapia all this stuff there's so many in here viejas those big you know freaking flower horn looking things there are some in here we've caught a bunch before we're back at it today with another fish trap and we're actually going to place it inside the tunnel so yeah guys check this out this is a huge freaking tunnel and i was thinking we've never placed like the trap really far into there so i'm actually going to walk like 20 feet into it and place the trap in the middle of this freaking pipe this is going to be crazy guys i can't wait to see what we catch today this spot always produces something cool and new so uh, yeah let's get our trap baited up we got some good old bread. All right, we got some bread. What do you think, two pieces? Yeah, two? rip it up a little bit though. It's good. Zip it on up, guys. We're ready to place the fish up. Ah! A little fun fact, okay? A little interesting thing, Brandon. Brandon knows what I'm talking about. We were here last night trying to film a video, which didn't end up happening because Brandon was holding the camera and, you know, the klutz that he is, he, he tripped on something, completely fell over, and my phone actually dropped into the water and it took us like 10 minutes to find it. When we finally did, it was completely shut off and now it doesn't work. So, thanks Brandon. Okay, here we go. This is actually really scary. Guys, please drop a like. Um, I could walk through the whole thing, but I, I don't want to. Oh my God, this is so freaking scary. I'm doing it for you guys. I'm freaking wasting the guitar right now. Please let me. Check out. I might just throw it, I'm scared. Ah! Ah! The trap is set. I was actually really scared. That, that's scary because like, dude, an alligator could just like pop up and I'm toast. We have smirked it up quite a bit, but it is pretty far in there. I'd say like 10 feet in. So maybe there's some cool fish living in the tunnels. The usual, we're going to give this trap like two, three hours. We're going to come back. Hopefully we get something really cool. If we do, you already know the drill guys. We're bringing it back to the ponds and tanks. So uh, yeah, we'll see you in a couple hours when we check the trap. All right, guys, we're back at the spot. I'm pretty scared and I'm also very excited because I have to walk in there again and grab the trap, but... You know, we might catch something really cool, so it'll be worth it. Uh, too much McDonald's. I see I see the rope. The rope actually floated this way, which is good. I can just grab the rope. Water. Check this out, guys. Okay. Oh. Oh, dude. Oh my god. No, I can literally see everything, and there's a freaking big blue one. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh, that scared me. There's one on the outside. Oh, we got a lot. Oh, we got a lot. Wait, where did that blue one go? Guys, I saw blue. Oh, a jaguar. Where's a jaguar right there? Oh my God, Brandon. Brandon, holy crap, hold this, hold this. Dude, there's no way. Oh my God. Holy Whoa. crap. Dude. Look at those blue ones. Those are freaking Mabunas. Oh, Mabunas. We got Mabunas. There's no way we just caught Mabunas. Mabusis? Brandon. Oh my god, Brandon doesn't know too much about cichlids or whatever. I this knew. Is a freaking Mabuna. Two of them. Buna? I have some in my tank. They're called, they're an African cichlid. Look at this. They're the big blue ones, dude. This is insane. Oh, oh my gosh. Brandon, look at this. We got so many, oh though. Oh my god. Look at the blue. Okay, oh. let's get them in the bucket. Let's get everything into the bucket. Dude, we caught so many fish today. Look at all the jewel cichlids. Jewel cichlids. Oh, look at the freaking Mabunas. That is the coolest freaking thing we've ever caught in here. Oh, I'm so excited right now. I am so freaking excited. Okay, guys, aerator, let's get all the bread out. So, I'm gonna roll a clip right now. There was a time when we did a fish trap here. That one's blue. That one's freaking blue. <gasps> that one's blue! It was my first time ever here and I saw a very blue, it was just as blue as these guys. It was probably one of them. It was an insanely blue African and I thought it was just a really big blue. Oh my God. I had no idea it was Mabunas. That is so freaking sick, guys. That is probably the coolest cichlid we've caught out of here. Like, super rare. Oh my god. And they're massive, too. Two of them. Where's the other one? We got two, right? 
There he is. <gasps> Look at this. Look at that. The tail too. Those are two males, two big males. They're like the same size. Oh, oh my God. I am freaking out right now, guys. This is insane. Like we catch Africans here a lot. You know, a lot of African cichlids, it's very broad. We've caught mainly Eastern happies, which are, let's see if I can find one. We definitely caught some. Here's one right here. This is an African cichlid called an Eastern happy. Um, but they, you know, they're sort of the same species, but not really. We've caught bumblebee cichlids here, uh, which are also very rare, but nothing like that, dude. The Mabunas are insane. Oh my gosh. Mabuna, Mabuna, Mabuna. There's Mabuna. my Mabuna. Mabuna dance. Oh, there was a jaguar in here. Where's that jaguar at? Oh, there we go, Jewel cichlid. Oh, look at the red on him, beautiful. I didn't really get a good look at anything else. I was freaking out about the Mabunas. There we go, we're in the sun now, you can see them better. Holy crap. That is massive too. I don't think they normally get that big, dude. I have some in my tank, they're like that big. What else do we have? There's the Jaguar. There's a Jag, so sick. We got one of these in the tank already too. Yo, those are really cool. Okay. You guys, check it out. We have all the finds today in the orange bucket. We got some clean water in the white one. We're gonna show off every fish we've caught. You know, you never know, something might've snuck it. Oh, what's this? That's a tilapia. All right, that's one species. We got some African cichlids, some Eastern happies. That's two species. What else? Jaguar, oh, I got water in my eye. Mayan cichlid, that's three. Jaguar, four species, dude. Oh my gosh, we're killing it. Another Eastern happy, beautiful. Jewel cichlid, what is that, five species? That's a really pretty one. Another Mayan. Mabuna baby, Mabuna. Guys, go down there, comment Mabuna baby. We freaking did it. This has been, actually I have a friend who catches these in like Orlando area, very far from me. And I wanted to go up there and catch them very soon, but dude, now I don't have to, I got my own spot. There's the other one, such a beautiful fish. Oh my gosh. Another Eastern happy, some more jewels. Those are bass candy right there. Check that out, yo look. Look at the color difference. You see that? Like, look at the color difference bef between the Mabunas and everything else. Everything else is so dark and then you got those blue electric. That is definitely what I saw. Oh, I'm so happy I found out what it was. I walked up and boom, it was like just this color, exactly that. I was like, what the freaking heck is that? Woo! That was a very successful trap, if I do say so myself. Mabuna cichlids, guys. Scratch another cichlid off the list in this canal. This is absolutely insane. If you guys want us to come back, you know, keep exploring this canal, see what else is in here, let me know. But dude, this is like so interesting to me. Like, see, there's backyards right there, dude. There could be like, there could have been like a cichlid breeder, you know, how to add ponds in his back, maybe a big hurricane or a flood, and they just flooded straight into here, you know? It's so interesting to think about how they actually got in here. But uh, yeah, let's head up to the truck. Let's get these guys situated. We're definitely gonna bring them all back to the house. Fish chat was a freaking success. We'll see you back in my house. Dude, look at that. Look at how blue they are. Oh my gosh, I cannot get over that. <laughs> Brandon, are you seeing that? Uh -huh. Thing is massive. Oh my God. All right guys, we're here at the 125 gallon cichlid tank. Most of the fish in here you see are wild caught. This tank is freaking insane, dude. We have everything imaginable in one tank and it all works, it is super cool. So these Mabunas, I actually, we're building a new pond, you know, it's gonna be freaking huge. And I really wanna put a lot of big African cichlids in there and you know, colorful cichlids. So eventually we're gonna move that into there when it's done. But for now, we're gonna put them into the 100, 125 gallon for now. There's one, dude, they are so sick. Ready, here we go. Oh my God. Dude, that thing is freaking massive. Look at them compared to the other one. Let's get the other one in there. This one's a little lighter colored. So sick, here we go. There they go. Oh my gosh, they look amazing in there. Wow. Look at the other one, dude. <laughs> Shake it. He's, he's asserting his dominance. All right, and the rest of these, um, we're gonna feed most of like the mines and whatever to the bass and the Africans are probably gonna go into the African cichlid pond. They look so cool in there. This is temporarily, they're not gonna be in here like forever. Once I, like I said, you know, we're gonna put them into the big pond eventually, but yeah, for now, they'll be good in here. Okay guys, we're here at the pool pond, check it out. I mentioned in the last video, I'm getting a UV filter for it. Boom, there it is, that has a UV filter built into it. Lots of, I, I, I set it up yesterday and it's already looking so much better. So in like a day or so, this should be like as clear as the koi pond. Yeah, let's feed the fish. Let's get some of these Mayans. Here we go, Bane, come on. All right, here we go. We're gonna feed Bane the bass. Get it. 
Oh, oh, here he comes. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go, Bane. A little hand feed. All right. Oh, my God. Get him. Look at the size of that bass, bro. That is like the biggest bass anyone has ever had. Get him. Gonna break the new filter. The rest we're probably gonna throw into the cichlid pond or whatever. They're breeding in there actually. I've seen babies. There, that is the cichlid pond, the pocket pond, all that. There's actually baby African cichlids in there. They started breeding, so that's super cool. We're gonna put the rest into there. Let me show you the progress on the new pond. It is crazy. Guys, right, so let me give you a little rundown. Just a little sneak peek, you know, nothing's done yet. Right here is a part of our new filtration. Dude, this is insane. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be a big old filtration system. We're gonna have lots of plants in here filtering, lots of lava rocks, power balls, all that. We're gonna go in through here, come out, go down this huge waterfall we're gonna build up. It's gonna be so cool, guys. And look at the size of it, and we're not even done digging it. It's kind of hard to tell on camera, but look, like, dude, I could do laps in this. I can literally do laps. This is crazy. Right around. We got some massive rocks here, dude. Make a big old waterfall, guys. This is going to be the coolest thing ever. This is going to take the channel to a whole nother level. I cannot wait for it to be done. The pond liner and all that is coming in a couple days. So we should have it running here in maybe a week or two. It should be done. We're going to do a big reveal and show you it. Um, but yeah, if you did enjoy the video, go down there, hit the like button, subscribe down below. If you haven't already, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.